There are growing concerns that a cemetery in Tampa has a parking area over unmarked graves of black and Hispanic people. Today, residents are putting pressure on Tampa City Council members to figure out if that's true. News Channel 8's Ty Russell joins us. He is live in Tampa tonight. Ty. Well, Stacey, the Italian Club of Tampa was initially scheduled to address these concerns back in May and today. But once again, the group had to tell city leaders that they were unable to make it. So the item was pulled from the agenda. During public comment at the Tampa City Council meeting, people expressed concerns over what they say are unmarked graves at the Italian Club Cemetery. Seems to me the current generation that's in charge step up, take responsibility, and make it right. It's simple. Eileen Henderson is focused on the area where people are now parking during burials. The privately owned cemetery was purchased back in the 1890s from a pioneer black family in Tampa. And how every time it's a cemetery or something that's ran over, neglected, uh, blatantly disrespected. It have to be people of color. One woman told the council a relative was laid to rest there and she wants to know where his body is located. To care so little about their dignity, including that of my great uncle who was lost there, many of the Cubans buried there had little to no family and were immigrants here. And right now, I was able to reach out to the Italian Club of Tampa. I'm still waiting to hear back. Now, it is still unclear whether the group will appear at a future meeting. Stacy. Well, this certainly isn't the first time we've heard about these types of issues and concerns at local cemeteries. But why do leaders say their hands are tied in this case, Ty? Well, leaders have been saying if a cemetery is publicly owned, they can regulate it. However, they say the hard part comes when one is privately owned. There is only so much they can do. Stacy. All right. Ty Russell live in Tampa tonight. Thank you.